today should be my first day off, but of course the boss doesn't like people having time off, so she's called me in. So I'm gonna go in for about an hour and then, yeah, see what she wants. to work today like I said uh, wasted a little bit of time with my boss literally just a chat a chit chat about nothing to do with anything that's like work related or anything like that so but whatever she's bored I went there it wasn't far and it wasn't too long and then on my way back I stopped at five supermarkets like two really big supermarkets and three like 7-eleven or convenience stores and um, hair beauty and makeup stores like that and I was looking for a deodorant. <laughs> Can you believe it? Looking for a deodorant. Nowhere is selling deodorant right now. All like two of them said, like the two big supermarkets, they said, oh yeah, in summer we sell it, in winter we don't sell it. And it looked at me funny like, why would you even ask that in winter? <laughs> it's like I asked if they sell shorts and it's like winter. I was like, why would you ask that? Now, I don't know about you guys, but I'm used to just putting it, you know, every morning I wake up before I go out, I just, tss, tss, you know, give myself a quick spray. Not like a body spray, but like armpits. I'm like, tss, tss, left and right armpits, give myself a quick spray and then head out. And it's not because I think I'm particularly smelly or because I sweat a lot or something. It's just habit. And um, also, it just makes me feel a bit more secure, I guess, because it, I just think if I do start sweating, it probably ain't gonna stink like sweat. Anyway, right now I'm out of deodorant. And the thing is tomorrow, I'm gonna do some action sports, which we'll find out all about tomorrow. But I just, want to get that deodorant and they don't have it anywhere <sighs> so now I'm like without deodorant those of you who never use deodorant you don't understand so don't worry about it those of you who use deodorant every day you'll understand it all right I'm gonna eat now okay so the time has arrived where I need to go and meet Hillary in preparation to go to her house because you know spring festival is coming up and everyone's on holiday now so I'm going there tonight and then tomorrow morning, me, Hillary, and her brother are going out to do something cool, which you'll see all tomorrow. And then the next day, me and Hillary at some point will come back here to the middle of the city to, I guess, in preparation for my mum and dad who are coming the following day. Is that right? What day is today? Third? Fourth? Fifth? Sixth? Yeah, that's right. So, it's going to be an action-packed few days, and um, yeah, I'm taking my hard drive, my removable hard drive. You can see here how big it is. This bad boy is one terabyte. One terabyte. It's about five, four or five years old now. This, more than that. I got this hard drive before I came to China and I had it about a year. So it must be about five years old, this one. And this is how big one terabyte hard drives were back then. Now I've got two of these. I've got one and two over there. And I've got my computer, which has a terabyte in there as well. And <clears throat> I'm beginning to run out of space, so I'm going to soon buy a new removable hard drive, and I want it to be like a huge one. So what's the biggest removable hard drive that there is out there now? I'm hoping I can get like a 5 terabyte one or something like that, that's just going to keep me going for, you know, the next 5 or 6 years or something like that. I don't know. But yeah, it's crazy how much extra space that we use these days. I remember when I had a PC, it was eight gigabytes. And I thought that was, oh my God, who's gonna need eight gigabytes? And now eight gigabytes, I have eight gigabytes of RAM. No, I have 16 gigabytes of RAM. RAM. So you imagine a terabyte now is nothing. Ugh. So yeah, I need to upgrade onwards and upwards. <sighs> so this is my gym bag and I've got to pack it now with, oh, what's this, food? Don't need it. So I pack it with stuff now that I'm going to take to Hillary's house, clothes for the next couple of days, and the stuff that I'm going to need like cables and battery and computer and everything like that. Ugh, it's so annoying. It's a nice evening. Oh, my bag's packed. 
got my backpack and I've got my gym bag. When I see Hillary, she's going to say, oh, you've taken too many things, but I'm organized, you see. In my backpack, I've got my electrical stuff, laptop, hard drive, cables, and in there, got all the stuff that doesn't matter. My clothes, wash stuff, that stuff. And I'd rather have more than enough than not enough, you know what I mean? Now to go find Hillary, join the rush hour traffic, and get to her house. Taking the stupid subway, now I'm near Hillary's house. So now I'm at Hillary's house, getting ready to go to bed. She's sat there practicing her English. I'm sat here editing some videos. And yes. It's true. Tomorrow, like I said, we've got a really cool day planned. I have to wait until tomorrow to tell you all about it though, because right now I'm at their house and it's like quiet time. I'm gonna go to bed. See you tomorrow. Bye bye.